Min Shem. Well, we can put it here. Min Shem. It says Min Shem. In Surah Flap, we see protection from four evils. Four evils are being sought right here in Surah Flap. The e evil creatures. Because we're talking about from evil, right? The evil of, right? From the evil of four things. Evil creatures. Um, the evil in darkness. We're seeking refuge from sorcery. And we're seeking refuge from haters and jealousy, right? Haters. Jealous haters. These are the four things that we're seeking refuge from and, and from their evil in this sort. Also, I want you guys to understand something. Tell me when you're ready. Okay? So, because when we say, understand that you're saying, I'm seeking refuge in the Lord of Lightness from the evil of evil creatures, evil and darkness, sorcery, and jealous haters. Min sharri ma khalaq. Ma khalaq here, it doesn't mean everything that Allah created. This is, a very, this is a point that we have to understand very, very clear before I go. I, I missed a the point. There are two types of evils. Can I erase this right here? No. Come on, baby girls. Can I erase it, please? Thank you very much. It says, there are two types of evils. There's existing evils, two types. <coughs> And I'm going to name certain other things also. There's an existing and a potential. Forget my hand right now. It's potential, okay. Potential evil. Okay, so now, these two dots mean ditto, okay? So, these are the two types of evil. From the existing evil, we seek refuge in Allah. From it, we want it to be removed, right? Right or wrong? Yes. And from the potential evil, we want it not to occur. So we want protection from it. Okay? We want protection to prevent it. We want preventive, I should say preventive. Preventive help. And we want removal from that. <clears throat> you, you, is that clear? Yeah. Also with regards to evil. What does evil connotate? Evil is two things, they said. Pain and the experience to pain. And what it means, the experience to pain, it's referring to any type of way that you can, the fastest way possible, the immediate advantageous way without any regard to ethics. This is what expedient means. To, to get the objective that you're looking for. All right? So this is what pain, so I mean evil is. Evil is pain or something that's gonna make, help you get that pain, get to that pain. And another part here, it says that the evil, not just two types, it comes from two sources. Two sources. It's all about evil. Evil comes from two sources. Two types of evil, existing potential. Evil is pain and things that bring pain, okay? Now the two sources that evil comes from, the first one is yourself. And this is the most constant. And some scholars say it's the most evil, the most detrimental. is the evil that comes from yourself, from some sins that you do, or things that you don't do. So it's true what they say, we are our worst enemies. Right? It's true. Since this is the most constant and the most detrimental type of evil. And the second source of evil is from someone or something else. The someone could be a person. The something could be a genie or a devil. Okay? 
These are the sources. When we talk about the evil here, we're talking about understand what evil is. And if we understood what evil was, then we could fully recite this surah and get the benefits out of it. Because first of all, when I learned that the sources of evil are our own selves, first and foremost, and then some jinns and stuff like that, then we can easily protect ourselves from the most detrimental type of sin by what? By doing what? If sins in our own self are the main cause of our, of our hardship, what can we do? We can stop sinning. Right? <coughs> now? Okay, they want you to pray over here. I'm sorry. We can stop sinning. Inshallah, Allah, may Allah protect us and help us to stop sinning. 